25. Standing by to activate the sound suppression water system in five seconds. 15. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7. Go for main engine start. Three main engines up and burning. Three. We have a cutoff. Pass the BFS at 101, LDB goes 1. CTE assist the E, perform OSC support. CLA station is in progress. A copy, CDR NTD panel 06. The main engine cut off. CDR NTD panel 06, CTC mode 5. Safing in work. Gotcha, Ben. Take it in work. NHD GLS, mission set to safe. All three engines are showing post shutdown standby. We'll go for orbiter HP shutdown with no MPS fire detectors trip. Orbiter access arm now back in position. Copy CDR PLP entity perform APU shutdown. APU shutdown and work. CMPL C Lock verified lock fleet pass. CMPL rear powder is on. C Lock verified. Discovery is now in the uh, safe configuration. Crew is in no danger. MPS copies in work. CMPL fire detection status. Uh, CMPL, no fire detectors trip. CGLS, still no fire detectors on your screen. That's correct, and our primary shaping is complete. We're go for transition to G9. I copy. MCL, water daily is still on. The water is on. CLHY, leak detector status. Okay, Bill, uh, this is uh, fire number one. Will you get us uh, the TSM reading? CBS Air Fox 21. All personnel post support safety checks are complete. Proceed to recycle control sequence, sequence 18 on page 1045. Verification that the space shuttle is safe. We have no uh, indication of any fires in the uh, aft area. Please perform your recycle. The OA extended lock configured to re retract. Sir, sir, sir. This was to have been the 17th flight of Discovery. It has been flown more than than any other shuttle. NASA ground controllers, when asked yesterday about the, the two previous scrubs because of equipment problems. We have an indication of a fuel flow rate uh, failure on engine number two. This uh, occurred while a uh, health check of the number two engine was being performed. Uh, no indication yet uh, this uh, really occurred. We're looking at the data. Oh, the astronauts, the five crew members, emerged from there, still smiling. This is the third time that that has happened to these crew members, to emerge rather than go into space. An obviously frustrating time for the astronauts, but as NASA has often said, better to have everything working correctly when they go into space than have a problem.